Welcome back. We're playing some more cards. It's been a little bit. I took the weekend to uh, get all the videos ready for uploading. And I'm gonna only, only going to be doing one stream a day uh, until I get that done because I really need to get on it. Because of the whole YouTube multi-streaming changes, uh, it's just better for VODs. I don't have to, like, download them. I don't have to like just like download re-upload even though I, I I might not go through with it because I it might just be easier to just like in case of mistakes you know I don't want to like upload to YouTube a vod where I like pull up my email by accident it's like that's not a good idea I have to edit those or like where there's like a huge error section that's just like blacked out or like audio gets cut i still upload the cut audio things actually i shouldn't say cut audio because i just let that slide sometimes i don't know how to fix it i don't know how to appeal it um frankly on paperwork i'm in i'm on the ground i'm rock bottom on any sort of paperwork ability i don't have a lot of what i need for paperwork stuff, which is also why uh, I need to set up a proper donation thing because uh, I can't get paid through Twitch. Even the money I get through Twitch is going to get mailed to an old address that I have no power to change anymore. So I need to like make a few calls or something. But anyway, that's not what today's about. Today's about finally beating... Challenge level four. Now, I did say I'm only doing one stream. They might be longer streams to compensate because I do, I do really enjoy this game. So we are doing at least two runs. I might go crazy and do a third. Maybe even a fourth if they're fast enough. What are we thinking, totem? Probably totem. Oh, check what do we got. And also, if we get ringworm, ant queen, and adder, so we only need an adder. Ringworm, adder, please. <sighs> well, shit, man. I could fecundity ant queen. It could be good, you know? I think we'll do that. Another Ant Queen's nice, you know. And we are gonna go for Totem because we didn't get a Ringworm. Oh, fuck. Shit. I mean, I'll guess I'll take this. I don't want to. We need a good totem. And a to I can probably win a totem fight. It's the first area. Totem fights, sh I shouldn't be scared of them. I'm gonna have to fight every fight as a totem fight at some point. Okay. We have fly blocking birds. Gotcha. So like what birds should be. Understood. Okay. Uh oh. <sighs> That's not good. Uh, beep bop, boop bop. Uh, beep boop, boop, beep, boop. Um, Bob. Yeah, yeah. I 
I don't want to win too quick. He's going to concede here, I think. If I don't, I mean, I'm just going to kill him. We're going to negative his zero. Fuck it. All right. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Good. <laughs> it was like super loud. Oh, flying ant. I really don't want to re Don't, I, oh. Words, come on, baby. You got this. I don't want to pass on it. If we get the adder, we get the adder, you know? It, it'll happen. Maybe it'll happen at some point. I think there's another. There's more opportunities. There will be more. Fucking. I don't have birds or other thing. I'm just gonna get another body, I guess. I really should grab, like, a headpiece. But I need bug. I'm a bug player. I'm bugging. Yeah, he's being chill about it. Cool. Doesn't really matter. Money. Teeth. Mm, what way do we go? I think this way. No. Well, fucking. <laughs> Come on, man. They get sparrow, I guess. Fucking. Why are you gonna do me like that? Let's feed the sparrow. We don't. I don't really want it, but if it's a strong sparrow, then it's good. Okay. Good. I don't want it in my deck. It just, like, spoils it. It's a rotten deck. Going up that way because totem. Oh, but there's totem over here. Okay, hold on. Let's analyze our options properly before we make any brash judgments. Flying ant. act like nothing's gonna fucking come down this aisle but it's gonna here watch boop oh but that's nothing that's nothing okay we are gonna need to find some solution to this but we might just be able to out damage it like we're gonna be doing four they're gonna be doing three right 
pretty sure. Yeah. So now, no matter what, we win. Okay, well, we didn't get any more information, but we know that it doesn't matter what path we pick. So what do we prefer? Do we want to just totem sacrifice? Or do we want the chance to burn? I think we're going to go this way. Give us a better idea of what we're doing. Fuck. You. I guess it's fucking... Um... I think Raven Egg, because if we put the growing thing on an Ant Queen, does it give us- I think it gives us two ants once it activates, right? Oh my god. <laughs> this is awful totem get like, just- please. Please. What's our deck, even? We have Bug Bug, a bird, which we're about to not have- we only have bugs! <laughs> I I don't know what else to do. Stop with the wolf and the deer. Is it area based? Am I like a silly billy? What's what's the deal, man? Elder Ant Queen. Maybe it's location-based, and I just didn't know. Well, I don't think so, though. Oh, <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's just a random chance. Given that we got snakeheads and birdheads earlier. The only one we haven't seen, I think, is Bug. Oh no, they have the pop-up ability. I think I'd lose here. <laughs> I think just outright. However, maybe I don't. How how twinteresting. Okay. have an interesting idea, right? We do this. I forgot that that one would move, but A, it worked out, it worked out. And now, we draw a card, we play it. We field mice this guy, cause he have of the health that we can exploit. Um, and now, I think we're more or less set up to troll. He can't do anything about it. <laughs> Cry about it. We're gonna draw our entire deck into our hand and then start drawing squirrels. That is unfortunately our entire thing, but we have a flying ant. I think we can still win, ultimately, because we have flying. I'm surprised, actually. I thought this was going to be really hard, but it I was able to exploit their weird mechanics. So we're kind of gaming on them. I just hope we don't get starved. Yeah, no, we're fine. Because now it's, oh, everything's gonna turn over and I should be really little scared. But I'm not. Let's trade. Thanks. Powerful creatures choose wisely. Do any of them have fly blocking? It doesn't look like any of them have fly blocking, so I'm just gonna take this flying ant here. You know. 
strange choices. <laughs> Buddy. How dare you? You know? How dare this guy? Strange choices. I'll show you a strange choice. Fighting me. Boom, got him. Almost a cool line, if it wasn't so fucking lame. Anyway. <laughs> Here we go! Second phase of Hunter is like a really, like, a pretty simple and easy version of those, like, chess puzzles you see. Where it's like fucking winning two moves, or like, how can white win this scenario? Hey, oh, pack rat. Cool. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Amalgam. Oh, but we already have a rat. We need a way to generate things, but Amalgam, though. Amalgam doesn't benefit you if you don't have a totem. Wait, Amalgam will come back. You'll get one. It's true. Take the pack rat. Honor the king. Ugh. I could go for the boon. Got a totem up here, that's pretty cool. Um, our deck is almost all bugs. We have three cards of non, oh, like, no. I wonder if those count as the same. Because we could go for the trial of kin, and I think that one will be there. But knowing my thoughts, I'm probably wrong, but I don't need a card right now. Let's just go over here and see what's up. What's up? Kin. Four blood or four power. A lot of our cards do cost two blood. In fact, the only way we lose this one with the blood one is if we draw all three single cost cards. So let's go with blood, because it's the most likely to succeed, I think. And we win. Ooh! That is a, an ant. Card bearing that is immune to the effects of touch of death and stinky. Oh, cool. I'm gonna go with the mantis though, because you've given me a mantis what growy? Scissors are good. I need to get rid of these boons. John Pork. <laughs> He haunts me. A bee and a board. I feel as though we should place our flying ant here to stop the board from doing its thingum. Um, but. Yeah. Oh, it's important. Plus it, no, oh no, because it won't attack it. Oi. Play 
the Elder Ant Queen. So now we're gonna do two. They're gonna do two. Yeah. Okay, I like the one that gives us the most visual choice. Adder! We're gonna take it for the challenge. So let me just go quickly look at it. I believe it's Adder far left, yeah, Adder far left, Ant Queen far right. Stinky bugs. I mean, honestly, having my bugs take less damage is pretty poggers. Should I go for the gamer challenge to get, like, another bug? Probably. I should probably go for the gamer challenge to get another bug. Okay, cool. We now have stinky bugs. Which means we can kind of be a little silly here. Oh my god. This is gonna get really silly. <sighs> you can't be playing one damage cards in here, son. I'm gonna stink him up. Welcome to stink bug strats. Oh, should I go for corp maggots? Could be good. It would give us a potential use for bones while still giving us a good sigil to back off of. Honestly, I feel like I'd put it on, like, an ant queen or something. Um... Yeah, let's do that. Health. Uh, let's give one point to a flying ant, just to make it a little bit stronger. Especially now that we're running stink, if we can build health, man, we'll be pretty strong, just saying. Alright, I think we use our items here and grab, uh... Grab another one. Okay, we have the adder. We just have to try and get the right uh, follow up. So right now we're kind of fucked, actually. Yeah, I think we are gonna lose. We're gonna need to draw. Play this. Maybe even do something like this so that we can just throw it on the field immediately. You know? So we have five. We could just throw him out and get him there. Yeah. I think we do that. We 
turn. He passes. Yep. And now we draw an act another card. Fuck. Uh no, this is fine. This is fine actually. One of the things that this is, I believe, is fine. Oh, it turns into Mantis God when it grows. Ah, awesome. Um... Please, Ant Queen? Okay, cool. Ant Queen, Ant Queen. We got an Ant Queen. So now... Um, well, not right now, but in a second we can do the puzzle. Taking two. And then we're going to be doing one, two, three again. Which won't win, which is good, which is exactly what we need. We need to not win. I mean, we do need to win, but not immediately. We can, we can do this. So now, we can Ant Queen over here, very good, and add her over here. We did the oil painting thing. And now we win. Could have pack rat for the item, but we're going to get an item anyway. And then we're going to feed the adder. What does this do? That pocket watch never stops ticking. Perhaps you would like to use it. What do it do? What what it do though? Oh, it's the clockwise thing. Oh, cool. That could be good. Yeah, the wise clock. I mean, why not, you know? Uh, see how it works, see how it goes. Oh, we should probably put health on our bugs. fish.
Just in case. I don't want them to take my thing, but I don't think they will. Nor do I think they can stop me here. I could have probably drawn for uh, another ant just to see what happens, but... question. Uh, oh, it's the, the Tao's question mark. Let's go with that one. Power of the sun in the palm of my hand. Uh, you beheld the beauty of the dawn. Only a faint clink sound ahead could distract you from the sight. You set out Palm, the woodland. Okay, um, this is usually where I get my ass beat, so I should probably play it safe. Let's look at our deck of many cards. I've been meaning to fecundity something. I should probably do that, huh? <clears throat> but what do I fecundity? Flying ant, probably? Is that way I could just, like, get another one? Uh, any combo I'm going for this run. Pro I, well, right now, our, I was trying to get a good totem. Um, but I got smelly, so now all of my bugs smell bad. Which has turned out to be very good so far. Uh, but that's just because we've been fighting lower HP things. Now it's going to start throwing m mooses at me, or meese. As a Canadian, it's meese. The plural of moose is meese. <sighs> and the plural of mice is mices. Uh, fecundity, yeah, it is not as awesome in this, in Casey's mod, uh, cause not infinite, but it's still nice. It's still nice to just get like a duplicate of a low cost thing. Maybe I put it on corpse maggots. You can also still throw it on Cockroach, and it can be pretty goofy, but it's not super reliable. You know, maybe Corpse Maggots is the way to go, but maybe I don't even want to sacrifice. I don't- I really don't know where to go. No matter what, I'm gonna have to sacrifice at some point. I feel like we go this way because I haven't- Got pelts. Like corpse and mice on like a bear. Yeah. No, very true. Uh, I feel like we go for kin here. Or mostly bugs. Thank you, God. Woo! But you don't benefit from bifurcated. Ant skink? It would summon ants by moving. And it would automatically do it. Hmm. I'm kind of tempted. The cuckoo would be nice. Because, you know, it's like flying. It does that. But I'm considering the fact that when you place this guy down, he's going to automatically go to where he gets hit and then break off his tail, which is going to give you two ants in your hand which you can follow up next turn with four damage, effectively. That's assuming you have no other ants, which I'm playing a mostly ants deck. Uh, the bifurcated cuckoo, though, it is very good. But ants suck? Now that's where you're wrong. Ants are awesome, because they're bugs, and bugs are cool. <laughs> for, for example, check out these cool bugs I found. This one grows a little bit, and this one is actually kind of spooky, because it turns into Mantis God, but I need to make it stronger. Which is hard to do, because it's already got sigils. Ants 
Ants do require a little bit of a weird play, though. Because, like, it's mostly on the defense. The emojis. <laughs> Listen. Okay. Uh, who do we sack? Do we put the pack rat on something? Do we fecundity an ant? I think we fecundity an ant. Fecundity, our higher HP ant. Okay. Okay, I have to think about this a little. I now have a lot of ants. And I do have an idea. And it's a little goofy. But hear me out, right? We... Uh, flying ant. Oh, it was an Ejirak! Fuck! Alright, well that works out, I guess. Cool. Now, we play a flying ant. And then, we just hit this funny little rotate button, and we play another ant. <laughs> we aren't winning immediately, unfortunately, because of that Ejirak, but hey, we have stinky bugs, so it's fine. Let's power up our ants some more. Baba Booey. Any challenges enable? Um, yeah, we have these ones. We got tipped scales, boss totems, and no hook. Because I'm, I'm just playing what I feel is both necessary and easy enough. Yeah. There are, there are many ways to approach. But yeah, Ejirak sweep indeed. Do I take the knife? I feel like we take the knife. We have a lot of money, but I feel like we take the knife. <sighs> I've had a lot of money, apparently. And we can still get the knife. With all of our money. We never have to visit that guy again, which is good, because this is the last area. Do we sacrifice a thing? Well... Uh, we could sacrifice... No, I don't think we need to. We could get rid of Skunk. It's kind of clouding up the place. Yeah. I think we're gonna get rid of Skunk. Go to items. I don't need another pack rat, though. They are always useful, I agree. I don't deny that. The pack rats are nice, but... My strategy revolves around having ants all the time. So if I don't, ha if I have too many other things in my ha in my deck, then I get in trouble. Because I've made it to the end with ants several times, but I haven't beat it. <laughs> I've like made it to the end of this particular difficulty of run several times. Okay. Another instance in which I believe I can prove the power of the skink.
I might do it again. I might do the same trick again. Um, what do I, do I, I mean, I guess I should work her ant, right? Not ant queen. Oh! Yeah, but why not, you know? Why, why, why not ant queen? What? Fuck it. <laughs> Let's be a little silly. We can be a little goofy. Because I'm gonna be even goofier when I do this. And that way I can immediately play another worker ant and kill this mole. Now admittedly I should have played the ant over where that elk just hit me because it would have stunk him and then he couldn't have actually hit me. But my brain turned off for a moment so that didn't happen. Goofy won Teenager Word of the Year in Germany recently. That's awesome. I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't doubt it. Granted, I'm in my 20s, but I still say Goofy all the time. Ken, please. Bug. 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 Hello, I'd- <gasps> Rat King! Oh, Raven Egg. How I would love to have. I actually, I don't. I don't like the dam builder thing. I don't like it at all. And wolf cub, no offense. I, I don't. I don't need you. But rat king with tail split and infinite summon could be goofy. Could be. It might not be. It might actually cloud up the area. Uh, but that's okay. Do we go for a new totem? <laughs> Stinky bugs is fun. But it could be stronger. I don't want to fully abandon it. We probably won't because it might not be... Yeah, we didn't get anything good. So I'm just gonna... I'm just... I, I mean, I'll take this. But we're gonna continue with stink bugs. Because I don't like the dams. I know that they're okay. Because they can block hits, and you can build a lot of time, and just build up your hand and whatnot, but I... Don't wanna. <laughs> I simply do not wish to. Okay. Gonna have to play a, a weird... Weird thing. We're gonna play weirdly here. I guess we have to. Um... I believe we do that. It doesn't matter where we put it. Because it's just gonna do its own thing. Yeah. Now that happens, that happens. I can draw. And. I believe our best move is to Rat King here. Fuck. Um, and then oh yes, we have stinky bugs. So if I could put it down, it would be fine. But I can't, so I shan't. Nope, I didn't consider that. Like you. <laughs> Fucking jeez. What an asshole.
I'm mad. <laughs> Fucking... Are we gonna die here? Because I didn't think... No, we're fine, we're fine. Okay. Uh, let's just grab another card here, just for funsies. Hit this button, win the game. You can get an amalgam if you go to the carver nine times, I think. Oh, cool. I was, I know, I knew that there was a interact. That's the old data right there. Um, should I just take it? It's gonna screw me over if I do. I really want it, cause it's like, haha, funny streamer card. But I've done like six, seven runs of this one difficulty, and we're only on difficulty four of twelve, I believe. <laughs> you know? Ha <sighs> Yeah, thank you. You've given me... Rat King! <laughs> Embrace the king. What if I put the Rat King on the Rat King, you know? What if we... Can we even do that? No, but we could make, like, the Pack Rat King. I don't even know what to do. I really don't know what to do. Fuck. Maybe put poison on something cheaper, you know? We now just have a rabbit pill. I forgot that that's what the knife did. Yeah, I, I I try not to kill my rats, but it's, it's part of the it's part of the rat kingdom. They know, they understand. They are part of the death cycle. Uh, let's put poison on something. I don't know what. Uh, it's a toxic rat king. Toxicant Queen, maybe? They are always on the ground. It's just like, I wish I could put it on like, I guess this could actually, this is probably the best option because anything that it's killing will be directly in front of it and then it will just fucking hit it after. So that could be good. Burning time. Oh, I know exactly who we're giving this to. Where is he? There you are. There you go, buddy. Do I go for the gamer extra power-up? I will almost certainly get my mantis eaten, but there's a chance that I don't get my mantis eaten. So, do I go for it? Google coin flip? Okay. I'm gonna have to alt tab for it. I guess we should establish which which options are what, huh? Okay. Heads we take it, tails we don't. Okay. Uh. Thank you, Lord! Praise! Okay. Here we go. This fucking guy. Plink. Okay. Uh, wow, we are immediately in a situation where we have not much we can do. 
Um, and he's playing a big old spike wolf. Fuck. Uh... <laughs> um... Hmm, 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 hmm. I think we pack rat. We're gonna have, like, just to do two damage, tank the hit. You know. I think that's what we do. Get an item out of it. Yeah, fucking bold. Ejerak! Let's fucking go! That's the best thing that could happen in that scenario. I <laughs> fucking... Okay. Thanks. Uh, I guess we draw... A card. I- wait, what do we rat- do we rat king? Or do we try and kill what we have here? I feel like we try and kill the things, that way we don't have as much to deal with. Um... I'm gonna draw a card, and grab boulder, we're gonna play the boulder here, and then we're going to chill for a bit, <laughs> while we build up a hand. Yeah. Kill the mule, but we'll, we'll do it in a second. Hey, that's pretty good. Uh, let's throw him down. Get some damage going there. Um. Draw some more fucking squirrels, I guess. Okay. Oh, am I? Am I fucked, you say? I'm do I dude, I'm in a great position right now. you're talking about. Grizzly? What about him? All these guys go away. And who says I have to fight him? <laughs> if I just never remove the wolf from the equation... So we start. With. Hmm. I think we start. With. Hmm. Ant Queen here, maybe? Now we have another ant. throw this down for this turn because I need here we go okay so how do we get out of this predicament we just need to do two damage and more importantly we need to block incoming attacks so, we flying ant to do two damage, and then these all will get turned into rocks. The mole will still be there. All of them go away. Uh, and now, we begin squirreling, or not squirreling, uh, anting. We have worker ants. 
Uh, starting with this guy. There's another squirrel. Ants are fucking awesome. It's not scuffed, it's planned. <laughs> I had this planned out from the fucking beginning of the round. I know what I'm doing. I love ants. <laughs> Bifurcated? I didn't notice that. Uh, well, we can deal with that still. Oh, we just have to throw down this work grant. And now we're fine. Well, I forgot about that. Okay. So. What do we do in this situation? We have a coyote? Oh, right. We got all the gifts from the whoozy what's Uh. Let's just coyote him then. Uh. And now. Yeah, I guess we can just go ahead and hit him, right? Well, actually, do it, Rat King. Beautiful. Okay. Fuck. Um, we don't really have a lot of time to do stuff with Ouroboros here, given that we're on the last part. Um, strange Larva is still a bug. Child 13 screws me over almost every time I take it. I'll take it, but I don't... It's not good for ants. For fair hand. We're, I don't know. I think... I feel like Strange Larva might just be the play here. But I'll I'll take Child 13. I'll do it. Learn how to use it. I know how to use it. Not in an ant deck is when you use it. <laughs> when you have things with, high, like, fucking... Perfect combo with one cost. I understand that. However, I'm playing ants, so having something that can't go away on the battlefield is a detriment. I can't get my full strength with something that can't die on the field. <laughs> Gold. I don't know what that means. Uh, fucking, do I totem? I have, oh right, no, I have a gold pelt. I guess we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll go here. Let's see what's up. I don't want to have this gold pelt in my hand. And I can get a mantis out of it. Sorry, Rat King. Didn't realize you were there. I have three? <laughs> I do have... I didn't realize I had three. I knew I had one. <laughs> well, there were... Oh, right, because, yeah, I forgot I was rich. For a moment, I was... Like, had a lot of money suddenly, and I had no idea where it came from. I guess just from ants. Always pick Mantis God, of course. Trifurcated? It's absurd. It's like, hey, whatever damage you're doing, triple it. It's like, oh, okay. Well, this is a good starting launch point. Uh, I think we'll start by Rat Kinging right here. Uh, I'm not gonna play any other cards because I want the Mole Man to hold that guy there. Oh, and he's also going to hit it real hard. That's unfortunate. That's not good at all, actually. Fuck. I think we just take a card. Alright. We do two damage, he gets... He doesn't even split? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I've just realized that these guys all have the tail split feature. Which means if I attack them at all, they'll move. Which 
also means, I believe... Yeah, three mantis gods. I'm really fucked, uh, just in general, but I think my big move is to do this. Because then he'll hit that, hit this, he'll move over, stopping this mantis god from coming down, leaving a tail that does nothing. He'll get smelly, so he can't actually do damage. Uh, and then I'll just be taking one damage here, and the gold nugget will get hit once. I believe. Yeah. Fucking don't do it. You stinky. What if I... I feel like we kind of have to, like, do this and maybe even that, but I don't know yet. But I'm worried! Ah! The only way I could guarantee it is by ant queening, and that doesn't help me because then the ant queen's on that side. So it doesn't help. Uh, jeez. I think for now... And this is gonna free up the next Mantis God. Fork. Oh. Uh, um, a golden outcome has appeared in my eyes. I've, I've seen it. I've seen the light. Stink up the that guy. We squirrel right here. She's gonna pull him up, making the mantis gone. We'll only have the one area to consider. Yes, this is exactly what I wanted. It is gonna free up that mantis god, but we won't have to worry about that for long. So now we're gonna be doing three gonna kill that mantis. Uh, and that mantis god coming down will free up that location. Oh! You're gonna let me trade with you next turn, you say? <laughs> Kinda tempted to just let it play out, you know? Trade for what you can, no, the, this, the rest will stay and fight for me. Mantis god, but ant! Oh no, I'm so struck in with uh, conflicting emotions. I think we go with this though, because that traps the Urayuli until next turn. Fuck, he moved over. <laughs> Mission Control. He moved. Boy. Fuck yeah. Okay. <laughs> Why won't you say anything? Um... Uh-oh. That's not good for us. We block the three damage with a squirrel, right? We take two. These two become blocks. I can then child 13. Maybe, right? 
think we this is the point where we use our this. Because I don't want them moving around anymore. I don't want them blocking this two damage I'm gonna get. So I'm gonna squirrel here. Just gonna turn them into gold. They're gonna break that. And I'm going to draw. Fuck. <sighs> Fucking child 13! Why? Okay, we can survive one more turn. From there, we can maybe pack rat, st like block this guy and do two damage to him. Or we could kill this guy, but that would bring in this other guy, which I don't want. Ideally, I'd like to get rid of this leg so we could hit through it. But we're in a really rough spot right now. So I think my only move is to take the 5 damage and go to 1 HP and then somehow miraculously block both attacks. Which could happen. Fuck Really? So no, even now, even no matter what I do, I'm fucked, I think. Because now I'm going to play this. I'm going to child 13. I'm going to child 13 fucking right here, too. Because it's like, I, it, it needs to block the damage. And I can squirrel, bop, bop, bip, rat pack. And now I just have another one of these, which I can't use. Now I'm gonna be left with nothing on my field after this. Cause this guy's gonna kill child 13. He's gonna steal my pack rat. And then he's gonna hit me with my own pack rat. And then I'd lose. Oh, I don't lose yet. I definitely do, but I don't lose officially yet. <laughs> Oh, you're back from the dead, eh? <laughs> Welcome back, child 13. Glad you could fucking make it. Should have taken a card and drawn what? <laughs> I couldn't, I had to draw a squirrel because I had no other choice. I had to play the rat in hopes that I got, like, a fucking fan or something so I could fly and just, like, hit him directly and block damage. But I couldn't, because he had the hook. Like, I mean, it's... I get what you're saying. We're gonna do another run immediately. We're doing ants still, because they're the best. Uh... We're gonna look at the oil painting, see what this is. Kingfisher magpie. Good fucking luck. You have to trick me into picking up a kingfisher. Oh, we take the rat king. We get the flying ant. Might be back later. Okie dokie. Have a good time. Wop, 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 wop. Well, <laughs> this is already a predicament. I'm just gonna let the turn pass. I'm gonna let the turn pass. I'm gonna pick up a squirrel. I'm gonna play a fucking skunk, probably. You know, and then just like draw another squirrel. So that way I can play Rat Queen here. 
throw down a squirrel. War Grant. Beth. Yeah, I, I bet you think so. I'm not satisfied with thought. Your consideration is appreciated, Leshy. Well, what are we going for? Oh, I know what, what I'm gonna pick. A fucking three. reason to go up there. I mean, aside from the totem, but I don't really like all these other things. I don't know. I don't really need a, a mighty skunk. A pack rat, always useful. Oh, is he? I hope so. about the whole blocking thing. <sighs> Sometimes you just forget. I'll take the magpie. It'll be useful in the future. Oh, maybe I'll make it useful right now. Just throw it on like another ant. Actually, <laughs> I shouldn't. Although, I could put Pack Rat on it. Or actually, I might just put it on Pack Rat. No, because I need it for the puzzle. Maybe we'll get a Kingfisher. But I'm going to put the pack on, like, Skunk, I think. Because one cost and I keep the skunk somehow for a really long time almost every run until like the end when I sacrifice it so if we're gonna keep him around might as well make him a literal pack mule I like to think that I haven't sacrificed the rat they've just create they've just formed a symbiotic relationship with each other well dang man <laughs> Crud dang. I guess we pull a tooth and then cast, you know? Hey, that was worth it. That gets us like another squirrel, effectively. Unless we get an actually good card, but nothing's better than another ant. Funny. I'm now in danger. <laughs> blah, 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 blah. 
That's how I feel right now. Uh, let's do that. Now we just win. Don't have to fight him. I think we go this way, right? We get another pack rat. Get a choice and a totem piece, which we need a totem before we go to the next area. Well, not before, but like in the next area, you know? I don't really want any birds. Okay, well, I'll take the black goat uh, for sacrifice potential. Get the bone boon, even though we don't really use bones. Don't want to be silly. I got a bug head, so now we know for a fact we're, we are in fact running bugs. Uh, a pack rat, always useful. Let's see what totem he has. All amphibians do what? Or all reptiles, rather. Frog is an amphibian, but they treat it like a reptile. Oh, they still have the same trait. Cool. Exploitable. Don't mind if the magpie dies. It's okay if it dies. It's allowed. What's our current hand? Ah! Uh, Probably need an ant queen. Right? Cause now they'll this guy's gonna move over to block this guy. Um Golden Pelt's gonna block that. And then these are gonna fight. Rabbit's gonna come down. Uh, and then the place will be clogged. Which is what we want. be weird, but I'm gonna voluntarily take a bit of damage here. I don't know why I didn't play the flying ant. It's because I want, uh... I want a certain set of circumstances to occur. We're gonna play the flying ant. Um... And we're going to, I think we're gonna cut this guy, but we can wait a turn. Um, so now we're gonna be taking the one and one back. Uh, from here, we can black goat and queen. Um, now we're going to be doing two, taking one. Uh, okay, we're going to be doing six damage. Because I'm going to uh, snip this. So now I believe this attack will ultimately become fruitless. So yeah, now all these guys are going to get replaced, and I can take one of them from these two rows and be fine. Hopefully. 
yes, I can take uh, this guy and be fine. It doesn't actually matter, but we are, we'll play it, just for funsies. There we go. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh, Ouroboros this early. Oh, but we could have the Ejirak, though. Ejirak, I think. No early Ouroboros, but Ejirak, you know? Hard, I just have a hard time turning him down. <laughs> Well, shit, man. I can either go the hard path, get a totem piece, or I could go the complete goober path, get a duplicate card, which we don't really benefit from right now, admittedly. Um, but this path's hard. Eh, let's take the hard path. Cockroach could be good. You never know what kind of build you're going to get. Bugs find bugs find bugs. The bug inspector <laughs> inspecting his bugs. It's gonna fucking starve me really quick for cards, but. <laughs> That's quite the start, you know? could get Ant Queen. Yeah. It was an Ejirak! <laughs> God damn. Silly Ejirak. I'm gonna make a weird play here. I forgot how this works. Um, so, oop. Oop is my uh, response. I think he moves to the right. Right? Place and a card bearing this sigil moves to the right. Yes. Okay. Top 10 Ejirak moment, um, to say the least. <laughs> oh, it gets silly fast. Oh, it gets silly fast. <laughs> We could definitely, if we can get an like an infinite death card now, now it'll be silly. Cause we can just summon an ant, get an infinite card, and then like, just go, we, we, it'll be goofy. Corpse maggots. Honestly, nah, I want them, but. Grizzo the Fowl. Hmm. No. Fine. We'll take a grizzly. I don't like him. So we're gonna feed him immediately to this fire. 
But if he survives, then I mean, oh, I could increase the health of the Ejirak, maybe. Oh, it won't let me look away. Uh, I have to pick one of the two. Or I could just do the thing I said where I feed the grizzly to the fire. Fucking... I think, right? What a dumb enemy. <laughs> Okay, this is the each rock. I'm almost certain of it. Gaming. Fucking troll. Ugh. cost. Wolf cub. We're gonna immediately put that on something else. I could put pack rat on something else again. Another one cost thing. this scenario I've been put in. <laughs> I don't like cutting in on ant time. So 
sometimes ant time just needs to be encroached upon. <laughs> Tank. Here you go. Tank. Do we shroomify them? Honestly, I might do a little silly tactic here. I might put the Ant Queen sigil on flying ants or we could sacrifice our non bugs fuck <laughs> tempted to kill the magpie and put it on like the fucking black goat because you know that way if we get a black goat we can summon the black goat and use it to pick up the bear immediately just at any point no pomp or circumstance necessary <laughs> and honestly if we get any of our low level bugs like our, our weaker bugs, we could, uh, you know what? A unity. <laughs> A unity of bug kind. I know it's the bad way to do it, but we gotta keep the Rat King around. He's our, he's our, like, good luck charm, effectively. Okay. Thinking about it, and I'm pretty sure we just have like guaranteed, like, you know, and we black goat, it turns out to be the Aegir Rock, and then we do this, and like we have Grizzly, you know. Now, I didn't consider the fact that. This is going to insta-kill me, more or less, if I play it the way I was about to play it. Which is unfortunate. Given how we're doing things, but uh, it has to happen. Now these guys are all gonna die, unfortunately. Roach. Um, we might just f fucking ant queen, you know. We're gonna have to win through normal ant means, I think. Cockroach, and I'd like, uh, <laughs> Rat King, please. <laughs> now I'd like to, um, the flying ant. I'd, I'll take the skunk, please. <laughs> Just 
win. We now can very heavily engineer our deck to our liking, which is very nice. Yeah, we don't really have to draw proper cards. We can just piggyback off of the fact that we can draw cards from bugs. And any non-bug, I will eventually make bug. We have bug, bug, non-bug, non-bug, bug, non-bug, non-bug, bug, non-bug, non bug, bug, non bug, bug. Oh, we don't, we don't actually have that many bug. Fuck. We need more bug. Trial of bug. We do have a lot of sigils. So I think we go for the sigils. Yay. Oh, the funny ant. <laughs> That's a silly little ant right there. <laughs> okay. What are we, items? Or do we fire? I think we fire. See what's going on here. Add damage. Well, now I know for a fact that this is the Ejirak. Because worker ants, I believe, can't get damage ups. That said, I'm gonna give it one. And I'm gonna back out, just to see what happens. Cause we know what one that is. That's the infinite ant, the infant. Infinant. Infant was a bad, bad choice of words. Poorly thought out. Mm -hmm. Now granted, if I was smart, I would have just given myself the Insta Grizzly with five damage instead of four, but we needed to do six for that to work anyway, so yeah, that pretty sure yeah position. Sorry. Fuck. 
Yes. Winning. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> that could be good. You know... Pack Cat could be good. Let's put... I don't want to sacrifice any of these boys! Flying cockroach, maybe? I think we'll just put ant- we'll make ant queen cheaper by putting it on, like... Cockroach! By putting it on cockroach! <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Ant spawn cockroach! Yeah! Yeah! That's silly. That, that might be silly. That could be silly. That has the potential to be silly. Uh, 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 uh. Now we I'm gonna use one of these. I know it does nothing right now. <sighs> it's all so that I can get the amalgam. And from here. I can grab Rat King, who from which I can spawn an ant, <laughs> from which I can spawn yet another ant. Goofy silly. Oh man. I don't really need cards, but I'll take special cards. Bones, kin, and health. I feel like we stand the best chance at kin. Those aren't kin! We get another pack rat, always useful. Here we grab the cat. Oh, hold on. Landon's calling me. Hello. I'm in your walls. That may be the case. Uh, that wouldn't be comfortable though, given that they're made of brick. That's pretty cool. Anyway. I will, uh, I assume you're in the call. Okay, I'll hop in uh, in a second. I'm just gonna finish this, uh, run in inscription and then end stream and I'll hop on. So I'll be there in a second. Minute. <laughs> uh, we do this. Uh, we can summon all our ants, I think, right? And then, uh, we can grab Rat King, and Flying Ant, <laughs> uh, we really gotta kill these 
of extra cards, because the, the chances are really what affect it now. Alright, time to turn in this pelt. Mantis God, please. Uh, Gek, actually, could be very strong here. Um, I believe, because... Uh, oh, no, never mind, because I was going to put the, re like, the resurrection thing on him. Um... take the mole man I don't want to but we will we're gonna take another pack rat and then we're going to put the backpack on something else uh yeah we're gonna put it on <laughs> Mole man. <laughs> Mole man, you can wear a backpack. You're like practically a man. Alright, I think I'm gonna start this one off with pulling my teeth, just in case. Or is this... Oh, this is the fishing. Okay, that's not bad. All right, and we're set. Everything is all good, folks. We can officially win because we've been given a single ant. So we're gonna start this off with the summoning of an ant. We're then gonna follow it up with a cat. We're gonna use the smoke to summon the, well, hold on, I gotta pull my tooth first. We're gonna use the smoke to summon the cat. Uh, and then we're going to summon the skunk, use it to summon Rat King, which will give us an ant, of whom... Oh, I fucked it up. But it's fine. <laughs> it's fine, because we can just do this. We gotta find our flying ant here. We kill him, we play this ant, we grab this worker ant here, uh, just in case, you know, just in case, sir. Go fish. Very true, very true. Yep, 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 can do, can do, guy. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, and now we just hit this button, just to ensure that we don't hit any of the buckets and that nothing happens, uh, and now we're good. Oh, this is what I was waiting for. We're gonna strange larva because it's a one cost bug. <laughs> one cost bugs are what get this gravy train a rolling. Now, what do we have in our inventory? We have no pelts. Um, do we want to put pack on something? I think so, honestly. Yeah, I think we're gonna put the pack on something else again. Just to get the rat out of the inventory. Um, and let's put it on the strange larva. <laughs> Fuck it. Many different backpacking bugs. Backpacking bugs that call out to each other. I think the first thing we do is get this boulder out of the way, right? Well. Interesting. We're gonna use the black goat to call the cat.
Huh. We're in a weird spot right now. Where we have absolutely zero bugs and no way to call them. Um, so we're going to play... A decent amount of just cards that can do something, you know? Uh, oh my god, we actually don't have any cards that do anything! <laughs> Fuck. I'm gonna do this. <laughs> the classic game move. Where it does this shit. It's just like. <laughs> I'm just stuck sitting here like, man, why you gotta do that? I don't want the grizzly, so I'm fine with losing him. I forgot that they did that. Mm. <laughs> yes! Bug. And it's the one that goes forever. Ejirok. Um, and then we'll throw down another worker ant. Oh, it actually did increase the strength of the normal ant. Okay, cool. So that strategy does work. Very cool. Um, let's grab the strange larva, I guess. Now let's let the turn pass. Don't threaten my boys. Oh, the bees have him infinite too. <laughs> Oh goodness. Oh my gosh. Infinite bees. There we go. Okay. Ow. Uh oh. And we lost anyway. Cool. Oversight moment. Classic oversight moment. I didn't use any of my items. I could have totally won that. I did it. I lost on an oversight again. Let's fucking go. I can't make it past level four. All right. Well, that's my one stream for today. Tomorrow I'll do another two attempts, I think. Uh, and then we'll see how it goes then. Maybe next time I won't fail on an oversight again for like the third time out of like the six to eight times I've tried. Anyway... Till next time, I've been Creature, you've been the lovely chat, this has been, oh, and the beautiful viewer at home, this has been, uh, Inscription Casey's Mod, and it's been fun. Bye. Goodbye. Bye now. See ya. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye.